Research these days is increasingly digital. Many disciplines are moving from more manual practices or point-and-click software to methods and analyses that involve writing or adapting code. Researchers might write or use code at many points in their workflow to run experiments, simulations or models, to clean or analyse their data or to present their findings in graphs, figures and papers. But when sharing their research, many researchers often leave the code out, as they may not know how to share it, or they may not think of their code as worth sharing. Instead, researchers are used to simply describing the analyses, models or processes they used the code for, or presenting only the outputs it created. But actually, sharing the code itself is the most accurate and complete way to show how the research was actually done. It preserves all the small details. That makes code an integral part of research. Code that is made freely available to others is called open code or open source software. The authors will assign it an open source license so others can legally reuse it and it should include documentation and metadata to help others use it properly, such as how to install it or comments in the code to explain how it works. However, it doesn't have to be perfect. The first step is simply to share it. There are a lot of benefits to sharing code. When others want to read and understand your research, or maybe even replicate or build off it, it is much easier for both them and you when all the code underlying it is openly available, ideally in one place. Others can see exactly what the code does or doesn't do. They can fix any problems and improve functionality by going straight to the source, and they can build upon your research without having to recreate it from scratch. This gives your work more impact. Open code also makes the transition much smoother if you or your collaborators leave a project and want to hand it over to someone else. Funders are increasingly seeing the value of sharing code and software, which means they are increasingly rewarding or even sometimes requiring it. There is a huge community of sharing code and software online, including tools, networks and support. It can be a big benefit as a researcher to access this. Often, researchers don't have formal education in programming, so might worry that their code is too messy or inelegant to share. But many others are in this same boat. Sharing messy code is better than sharing none, and you can take small steps to learn how to write cleaner, more reproducible code. Preparing code for sharing does take time, but it also improves the readability and findability of your code which your future self may appreciate. So don't hesitate. You can start small and it's okay to make errors. Code is an integral part of research output and it's important to share. To learn more, check out our UKRN primer on open code and software.